So we finished the last of our round uh, picking pails. Uh, hives are in pretty good shape. Um, they're ready for winter. So all we have to do is treat them with uh, oxalic acid vapor and we can bring them in in a few weeks. Uh, we, uh, we continue to monitor as we go through every, t every round we make. We continue to monitor for mites. Um, and we haven't found any mites on this, uh, this shake at all. Uh, which really surprises me because in the fall generally when all the brood hatches out you start getting escalating mite counts um, except for this year and what I I'm crediting um, the oxalic acid vapor treatment I we uh, conducted last fall we went around with a VM and we blasted the hives twice uh, with two grams um, per hive and uh, it knocked the mites down then, and we haven't seen counts back since. So I'll tell you just a little bit of a trial I did. Um, well, we did that, um, the mite vapor treatment. I left a control yard uh, without the vapor treatment. And before the treatments, uh, we were running 4 to 5%. After the treatments, about a week after the treatments, zero. That control yard went into winter with four to five percent. Um, the bees come out of winter last spring, a little rough. Um, I think it's because of the, the mites that were on them that fall. Um, so my overall hive loss by middle May was about 10 percent losses. Except for my control yard, I experienced a, a 75 percent loss right out of the shed. And those living hives still had about four or five percent uh, mite counts on them. So, so the, the, that oxalic acid treatment did a lot. And I'm still not seeing any mites right now. So I'm wondering if it, it wouldn't have got them all because we're, we're finding a mite here, a mite there, but it got most of those mites. Up here, uh, we run into a broodless uh, period. Um, we've always cursed it. Our winter's pretty long, they're confined for about five months. But I'm thinking maybe this broodless period we have up here, we can take advantage of. Uh, those mites aren't hiding, they're all exposed. So if we can target those mites at this time, um, I think this is going to be a huge advantage for us. With this oxalic acid treatment, it seems to be easy on the bees. Um, it's really cheap. Like I can treat the whole apiary for 50 bucks. It's a little bit time consuming, but uh, if we see the benefit of killing all these mites, I think we gotta look at it this. Uh, so anyways, that's just a little bit of uh, feedback I thought I'd provide for anybody who's interested. Uh, next week, we're going to start the vapor treatment. Uh, if the weather cooperates, we'll see.